In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Olerix and OBS Studio on the same system. You can use Olerix to add in your Bible presentation and song lyrics in OBS Studio using just one system. Without wasting much of your time, let's get started. So we're just going to head over to Olerix. This is Olerix over here. Make sure that you are connected to internet when doing this setup. So first of all, I'm just going to click on File and move to Display Settings. Now in Display Settings, I'm just going to click on Hide Screen. Next, click on Tools over here and scroll down. You will see Plugin Olerix. Click on Plugin Olerix. Now you have different IP address you can use. So I'm just going to copy the first one over here, which is view slash white screen. Copy it. Next, click on start server. So now just minimize it. Now you can move to the song lyrics you want to use. I have some write up over here. So I'm just going to double click and it's already live. So next, move to OBS Studio. Now in OBS Studio, I'm just going to create a new scene and title it as lyrics. Next, under sources, click on the plus icon and you will see browser source. Click on it. Now you can rename it. On the URL, I'm just going to paste in the link I copied. Next, under the width and height, this is where you can be able to put in the resolution you are using in OBS Studio. I'm just going to change it to 1080p. Next, scroll down and on the custom CSS, just delete it. And lastly, I'm just going to turn on these two options over here. With these options over here, you can be able to know whenever there is no internet connection between OBS Studio and Olerix. Next, I'm going to click on OK. And now, as you can see, I've successfully connected Olerix and OBS Studio together. Now, in Olerix, anything I display, it will show in OBS Studio. So I'm just going to change the slide. And now, as you can see, whatever I change here is showing in OBS Studio. And you can also add in some graphics. Next, I'm going to click on Move to Bible. And I'm going to minimize it so we can be able to see what you are doing in OBS Studio. And as you can see, we have our Bible presentation showing in OBS Studio. And if you want to change the verse, just click on Next, Next, Next. And if you want to go back to the song lyrics, just click on Go to the Lyrics. And when you double click, it automatically show in OBS Studio. If you want to learn more about Holerix, click the video up here to watch the tutorial. And as a beginner in media, this option is a great option, especially if you just have one system. You can do OBS Studio and Holerix on the same system and you can add in your Bible presentation and song lyrics in OBS Studio all for free. And if you have any question or you want to learn more about media, click the link in my bio or on the pinned comment to join my telegram channel and if you found this video helpful do not forget to hit the like button comment share and subscribe to this youtube channel my name is ebenezer from usa studio see you in my next video